Okay, here we are with another Mega Man Maker stage. Search, what was it called? Dang it, I already forgot, dude. Search Snake Sniper Remake. Yeah, created by Philly Buster there, so. This stage here is actually not a stage that Philly Buster made himself, but rather a remake of an of a old ass stage over on the Mega Man Maker forums. Like, I believe the ID of that stage was like number 85,003, something or other like that. So yeah, like, that's a very early stage. <laughs> and yeah, I already played through this one, but I wanted to go back and make a video of it, and I will actually be playing the original after, you know, I completed this stage here. Um, and yeah, what else is there to point out here that's noteworthy? Um, oh yeah, yeah, of course. Um, <laughs> The most notable thing here, as you can probably tell, all the tiles in here, well, perhaps not all, but most tiles in here are, you know, text edited, so, yeah, in order to make it look nicer. And it was created in the Mega Man or Mega Maker level editor there by Snowflakes. So, yeah, you can already tell here, like, we have a lot of cool things going on, like in the walls and, you know, the snake tiles overlapping and, you know, all kinds of crazy stuff, really. But yeah, um, I haven't played the original stage yet, so that will be blind. I do not know what changes, you know, Philly Buster has made to the stage here, so yeah, that's going to be exciting to try out that. And there we go. Yeah, wasn't so hard now, was it? Hmm. You know, I like that the Yoki blocks here are, you know, they aren't above a pit, which is nice to see. Like, I'm kind of surprised that such an old stage has not put more Yoki blocks over more deadly pits. Like, it's introduced fairly well, or maybe, you know, it might just be Philly Buster, you know, that has tweaked it a bit. I'm not sure, but if it, like, if the layout was the same in the original, like, I gotta say, I'm impressed by the level creator there, because usually, you know, back in the, in the old days, <laughs> Most stages were incredibly difficult, like even more so than now, and they weren't very well designed either. Um, I guess there are a lot of, you know, bad stages today too, you know, that just gets randomly uploaded. <laughs> but yeah, even more so, you know, in the early days. Ooh, yeah, this room here is pretty sweet. He's gotta kind of dunk his head with snakes here. And took some damage, but that's fine. Yeah. Mm. You know what, you could actually just sit here and take care of that guy. Oh yeah, and we have a particular room up here that really has some cool layout here with the umbrella enemies or whatever they are called. <laughs> they look, they kind of look like umbrellas to me anyway, the green guys there. Yeah, here. This here is pretty cool. I noticed that you could just climb straight up, but I think it's intended to be done something like that. But even if you don't do that, I tried and you can just make the climb if you just hold up here. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, that's right. We have this now. Ooh. More spikes. Yeah, and I think we can just skip this guy here, if memory serves correctly, and indeed it does. Yeah, like, the Yoko Block puzzles are quite intuitive, so, you know, I never struggled with them, even when I played this blind, like, yeah. Very well designed level, I gotta say. I'm not sure how much, you know, Philly Buster tweeted, but, you know, we'll see. It'll be interesting to try it out. And yeah, this boss here, you know, as well, quite cool, uh, quite nice, or quite a nice layout and, you know, a interesting setup here. Once again, it will be interesting to see how much Filibuster have, you know, changed 
things up, or if it actually was like this even back then. If the layout was like this back then, then I really <laughs> gotta upload the level creator there and come on, Sparkman. Come on! Get down from there. Or get down from there. Stop jumping around up there, I should say. More like. Uh, three more hits. Okay, surely we can get him now then. Very nice. Okay. So let me just look up the ID here real quick. Um, 85,003. 85,003. 85,003. There we go. But yeah, like, I already uploaded this level, a really, really nice level there. Yeah, let's just jump right into this. It was originally made by Pyrus, Pyrus there. Hmm. Oh wow, that was a very quick load time. <laughs> let's see how this stacks up to filibusters. Already we can tell there are some differences here. Um, yeah, holy cow, this is way simpler <laughs> in, in the terrain. Oh yeah, and look, the car enemies. Everybody used the car enemies back in the day. Everyone used them. Like, it's not even funny. Hmm. Yeah, the level has seen quite a big overhaul here. <laughs> like, no joking. Some serious work was made on this here. But, you know, we still have a nice, you know, I wouldn't still say this is a bad level by any means, I still think this is pretty good, like, especially for back then, like, we have a nice color scheme going, and, yeah, you know, some decent layout too, so, yeah. But yeah, man, these cars, like, back in the beginning of Mega Man Maker, we had so few enemies, so a lot of people <laughs> tended to use those guys there. <laughs> yeah. I was not one of them, though. What the hell? This is the secret room. Look at this. There are center tiles here that you can jump on through. I'm not gonna jump in here because I might exit on the other side and I don't want that. Um, or maybe I should not... Yeah, I can't do that actually. There. These are not center tiles there. But yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Philly Buster definitely made that more clear. You know, he added a little ladder down there. So that was a bit more obvious. And yeah, this series actually... Same Yoko Block pattern here, I remember this. Hmm. <laughs> look, look at this, it's so basic in comparison to Filibuster's version. So basic. <laughs> yeah, it looks so tame, like, so tame. I know it sounds like I'm, you know, nagging on the original stage, but yeah. Definitely not mean spirited. Definitely not. Yeah, and that is what I should have done in filibuster stage there. Like, you gotta shoot from this side, not from the other side. But of course, in this stage here, you can only shoot from up on the left. You can't. You don't have a ledge on the right side that we had in filibuster's uh, version there. Hmm. Nice. Yeah, like, once again, quite a, a quite fun stage to play through. And, you know, I assume this level was uploaded, like, in August or in, well, maybe in September or November of 2017. It must have been, I guess. So, you know, the game wasn't very old by then, so, yeah. For being that long while, like, for being that long back, you know, or... Yeah, for being made in the very start of Mega Man Maker, uh, you know, I'd say this is a pretty, pretty strong uh, design, or <laughs> Purus had a pretty strong sense of design, basically, is what I'm trying to say here. Yeah, this here segment was where we had those green parasol guys here, but yeah, here we have cars driving off instead. And of course, in Philly Buster's version, we have the Mega Man 3 enemies running back and forth here. Hmm. But yeah, you definitely do recognize a lot of the rooms. And yeah, Philly Buster definitely made some 
big changes. Like in here, we, I believe we only had spike. Well, not only spike floors, but we had spike floors in here in the original. If mer uh, memory serves me correctly. Hmm, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. I might actually, you know, there is that whole thread over on the Mega Man Maker forums with stages that was remade. I, I might actually want to try and make more of these types of videos because, yeah, this is very interesting. And yeah, look at this. This boss room existed back then too. <laughs> but he only takes one damage. Oh my goodness. Ooh, Philly Buster, you're a... Uh... Yeah. <laughs> you're... Yeah, you did the right call there, <laughs> basically. However, like, you do get more shots in all in here. Like, in Filibuster's level, you could only shoot at certain times here. Yeah, Filibuster's was a little bit more inventive there, you know, with the Yoku blocks in the boss room. Since you, we saw the Yoku blocks everywhere in the original level, he decided to include them here in the boss room as well, which, yeah, I gotta say, that was, that, that was a nice touch there. So, yeah, since he added those in order to, you know, he added the Yoki blocks in the room and the player would have to use them to get the snakes up to Sparkman. But yeah, he at the same time increased the damage, so... Both bosses probably take approximately the same time there, so... Hmm. But yeah, like, I'll probably add this level <laughs> in Philly Buster's playlist. Um, of any concern to you guys. Oh, just whatever. Oh, <laughs> I'm currently working on three hours of sleep here, so yeah, forgive me if my commentary is weirder than usual. <laughs> Ooh, but yeah, let's stop with that one as well. Like, yeah, to <laughs> Wow. Oh my god. It's August 2nd. What the heck? That was earlier than I thought. What the? That's insane. Yeah, that's hard to wrap your mind around. Or yeah, holy crap. But yeah, very cool stuff here. Like very cool stage overall. The remake definitely, you know, polished the original there, and it got even cooler. Like, yeah, filibuster basically polished up the visuals. Um, the layout changed slightly. You know, added spikes and. Changed up a few rooms, uh, you know, to modernize it, I guess, a bit. And, you know, the boss room was also changed up there to be a bit spiffier there. But yeah, like, overall, like, both creator did, creators did very well. So yeah, I'll probably make more of these in the future. Hopefully we get to see more remakes over on the forums, like, of old stages. This was a lot of fun. Definitely a lot of fun. So yeah, I'll just leave it at that. Um, thank you guys for watching. And have a nice day.